Today I'm going to show you how to work a provisional cast on using a spare circular needle or you can use the cable from an interchangeable set. This method is ideal because you um, have the stitches ready and waiting on a needle that you can just knit them off later on. So we start with a slip knot and onto the working needle. Tighten a bit and hold the tail in your right hand. Also hold the end of the circular needle or the cable in your right hand as well and then with your left hand the yarn goes over the index finger and hold the cable in your left hand as well. So the slip knot is, is stitch number one. To continue we go forwards and under the cable, grab the yarn from the top and bring it through. Then the needle goes behind the yarn and creates an extra wrap. Then under, grab the yarn and come back again. And there. Under, grab the yarn. Okay. Now if we need an even number of stitches we finish with the under manoeuvre. So let's check how many stitches we've got. We've got two, four, six, eight on the top and two, four, six, eight on the bottom. If you're asked to provisionally cast on an odd number of stitches, we finish with this and then we need to just wrap it around the needle, the uh, cable underneath. So the yarn comes down and just wraps around like that. Okay, so that's what our cast on looks like. Let's have a look at it from the other side. So this is what it looks like from, from here. And now I'm just going to purl across these stitches so we can have another look at it. Okay, so purl into it. Okay, nearly there. Okay, so let's have a look from this side again. This is the right side. So we've got two, four, six, eight, nine on the top, and two, four, six, eight, nine on the bottom. This one's a bit loose, but it'll even up once you once you knit with it. So let's have a look at knitting off the uh, provisional stitches. So we need to turn it around and I'm just going to bring the yarn across. So that I can knit it. Okay. So the the first stitch is um is mounted correctly and we would knit into that. And the, the next stitch, we need to see that this one is actually mounted backwards. So we need to knit into the back of this stitch. Now this one is, is mounted properly. So into the front and then into the back of this one to get it mounted correctly. into the front and into the back. Now here we've got an odd number of stitches 
So it's the even numbered ones that are mounted incorrectly. Conversely, if we had an even number of stitches, it would be the odd numbered ones that would be mounted backwards. So you just need to be observant and have a look at the mounting of these stitches. And the last one. And let's have another look. See? Very neat provisional cast on. There you have it.